Who are you when no one is looking? We are the little details that make us up. I personally like to completely disappear. And sometimes when I'm walking the streets of New York and people actually acknowledge my existence, I'm taken aback because I just forget that I'm seen and that I'm, I'm just there. But here are some things about me. I love the sun on my skin and I love being surrounded by tall trees and tall skyscrapers. I guess anything tall just makes me feel safe and okay, which is probably why I live in New York. And I spend most of my time alone, which I really truly enjoy. And I have some cliche things too. Like I love the sound of the crunching of snow underneath my feet. I love anything satisfying, really, like perfectly linear lines on a sheet of paper. Perfectly spacing the things on my sink, color organizing my shoes and my clothes. I like to trace the letters L and R on my skin. It can be on my arm or on my thigh. I just pretty much do it anywhere. And this is what I see in my head when I'm tracing these letters, but it's just a random compulsive thing. Let me know if you do anything like this. I love the look of snow on the branches in the winter. And I love taking naps in the middle of the afternoon. Sometimes I call them depression naps and I usually feel guilty when I wake up and I'm like, fuck, I have so much stuff to do. I love taking everything out of my sewing box or my purse and just putting all that shit back together. I love putting stickers on most things and they're usually fruit stickers just to remind people Eat your damn fruits. If someone gives me flowers, I'll literally keep them until they turn into dust. I love really intense workouts, which is surprising, but I love being screamed at by a trainer sweating my ass off. I love standing on my head and I love sharing my fears because I feel instantly liberated when I just fucking let them out. Feel free. And I love giving affection. I love giving love. I just feel like it's so natural to me to nourish and to want to touch and to heal. Uh -huh. My biggest insecurity right now is probably my acne, which is why I feel hesitant to film because I loathe wearing makeup, but I also still feel shameful of the way that I look sometimes, even though I know that it's just an illusion and the beauty industry is thriving off of me not being satisfied with my appearance. I do like to disappear. I think eventually I will just completely get off of social media, but I also really like being heard and seen. So who am I when no one is looking? A weirdo, pretty much. Yep. See you guys in my next video. Like this video if you liked it, and subscribe if you are not already. Thank you. I love you. Bye. I'm a weirdo who's filled with love. I will say that. Okay, bye.